Dear Mr. President, close your eyes and hear the cries of the American people. I come from a middle class family that struggles to make it from paycheck to paycheck. I have a proposal for you. Make health care mandatory for every citizen. These guys are excited because now they have a voice. Four years ago they kept saying, well, why do we care? Nobody cares what we think. We don't have a voice. What's the big deal? Before this project, I really didn't think about political issues because I didn't think it um, applied to me. It's great to feel like you have a position in society even if you don't have the ability to vote. I believe that if you say we the future, then we should have a say-so on what goes on in our country also. Letters to the Next President is a wonderful collaboration between the National Writing Project and Google, where the students use an online tool of Google Docs. Ultimately, we'll use that to publish online for a global audience. What are you writing about? What are the issues that you think that McCain, Obama, and the other folks who are running need to know? My topic is education. The economy. Immigration. Healthcare and the economy. The war in Iraq. I don't agree with discriminating against a group of people. So I think that gay rights is something that really needs to be addressed. The biggest issue that um, I'm taking a stand on is education because I believe that education is the backbone to everything in America. Every person should be required to pay a certain amount for health coverage based on their income. I want the next president to know about how single parents struggle and like they really can't put food on the table. I just got a car recently and I have to start thinking about gas prices and stuff like that and prices are getting a little heavy and that's why I chose energy. We were, you know, immediately excited about signing up and getting involved, um, introducing the kids to such a wonderful tool as Google Docs. My teacher can go and he'll edit the paper and give me feedback. Without us having to actually print something out and have him check it, he can just check it on his, uh, on his own computer. It was really exciting because we were actually discussing online. Um, I could respond and I usually respond in one color. She has her little blue writing down there at the bottom saying what she thinks. So it was fun to go, be able to go to Google Docs like that night and look at what she had written. It's less my imparting knowledge and us all learning together, which is I think a interactive uh, way of looking at uh, education for the future president that if he does get a chance to read any of our letters, like hopefully it'll open their eyes. We may not have as much knowledge as a, an adult, but we still hold those opinions and we are the future.